Apple Pay and Google Pay. Virtually everyone has heard of them, but not everyone can tell you how they actually work. Instead of taking out your wallet and digging through it to find the right debit or credit card to make a purchase, you can simply tap your phone at the register. But what are the benefits, if any, of using such a service? Are you better off continuing to use your physical cards, or should you make the switch? First, let's explain how Apple Pay works. All you have to do is scan your debit or credit card to add it to your phone's wallet. But it's different than physically using your card at the register in one critical way. Apple doesn't actually store your card number on your phone. Instead, when you set up a new card on Apple Pay, your phone encrypts the data before it's sent to Apple's servers. Then, Apple decrypts the data, determines your payment network, and sends your data and request to that network with a key that only the payment network can unlock. They then issue a device-specific number and unique transaction codes. Even if a criminal stole that code, they still wouldn't be able to use it to make another purchase because it's specific to a single transaction. Not only that, the merchant you're paying doesn't have access to your actual card number either, just the device number and transaction code. And again, even if for some reason the merchant kept the transaction code, each code is only good for one transaction. One huge benefit to this, of course, is that your card information is protected from skimming devices, which hackers attach to ATMs and card machines to steal your data. But another benefit is that Apple Pay keeps your data safe when making online purchases as well. And again, Apple doesn't even store a record of your transactions. Convenience is a benefit too. All you have to do is double click the power button on your iPhone, bring up your card with your face ID, touch ID, or passcode, and simply hold it against the card reader. No more swiping, entering a pin, clicking through multiple questions, and waiting. So even if someone stole your phone, they won't be able to use your Apple Pay without your face, passcode, or fingerprint. And if your phone is stolen, you can even use the Find My iPhone feature to remotely disable any cards you have set up. According to Apple's website, over 85% of retailers in the United States accept Apple Pay, anywhere that takes contactless payments. This is one of those things that seems like it's too good to be true, except for the fact that it is. Here's a technology that seems to be just as secure as it is convenient. It's a win-win. Happy web surfing. <laughs>